hey, hey, what's up, everybody? Brian with Happy Thumbs Gaming here, back with some more LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga. This is Level 2, the Bunta Eve Classic Free Play. We're going to get all of those Kyber Bricks, including the true Jedi status of 50,000, all five mini kits, and the challenges. Now, I want to point out, because I didn't really cover this before, the challenges all have names. And these challenges are not necessarily going to come in the order they're listed. So challenge one in our video may actually be challenge three on the list. Therefore, we have added the challenge names for easy tracking. So although challenge one may not match up with challenge one in the game menus, it'll still be easily tracked with the names. Speaking of tracking, if you get behind or want to jump ahead, we've got those quick links down below in the video description. Meanwhile, we're going to go ahead and choose our episodes and scroll down to the Boon to Eve Classic. As you can see, we're only 28% done. We did get a challenge in our first go, and that was the one for beating the ultimate lap time record. Now, as it sits, I don't know what it actually is, but I can tell you that on my first lap of story, I got 66 seconds and it worked. So that's the best I can do with that. I looked all over the internet, couldn't find anything. And we're off to mini kits. As soon as we start, you're gonna wanna lay off the throttle and stick to the hard right side, go to this lower ledge, which I didn't even know existed, and grab the first mini kit. Stay on the right side, although you might smash into some things like I just did, you're gonna wanna keep to the right. Once you get over the crater area with the big giant holes, you're gonna come around and there's going to be a service ramp and uh, we're going to use that for a challenge on level three but it's important to use that as a marker and to continue to stay right because if you do you'll find yourself some arches and a mini kit inside now i know we've been hanging hard to the right but now we got to get to the left that's right our goal is to get all the way over on the left side of the cave again letting off of the x or whatever button you're pushing to go is going to slow you down so be on it and off of it as soon as you exit the cave, stay on the right side and hook around to the far right wall. You'll see a destructible rock and right behind it will be mini kit number four. Holy cow, we are plowing through all of these. Now, right before you get to the exit or the uh, lap finish here on the left hand side is going to be the final mini kit. Whew, that was sort of a mouthful. Next up, we're going to work on the challenge called Takeover. That is actually for hitting three boost pads in one lap. You might have already gotten this in the story. If not, just focus on hitting the three pads. Now, even if you lose your pod stuff and you got to fix it, it's okay. You just got to hit three in one go. Now, I'm going to stick to the right and hit that service ramp not once, but twice, but on all three laps. And uh, that's going to give me the third boost for this particular one. Now, there's plenty of boosts all over the place. You shouldn't have any problem getting this one. And, in fact, uh, make sure that you're smashing into rocks along the way, too, to get that studdage all the way up. You can see we've got the true Jedi co -co -co complete. And now that we don't need to be on the left side to get that mini kit in the cave, I do recommend sticking on the right, as it just seems to make the trip through the cave easier. Now, as we make our way all the way down and around, we're about to complete our second lap here. Do not worry about placing. Don't worry about getting first or second. We actually do complete the race and get first, but I, I feel like as long as you're sort of on the throttle and uh, don't hit a bunch of stuff on the third lap, it's almost impossible. I know some of you didn't complete it on your first go or two, but uh, once you learn that you can be on and off the throttle for a little better control, you should be good to go. All right, third and final challenge. We need to hit the service ramp on lap three. Guess what? We're on lap three. There's the service ramp. Booyah kashow! Now, as I mentioned, don't worry about finishing the race, especially winning it. You can actually use the save and exit. We're not going to, because we never do. We've asked you guys in the past if you want to see us complete it or just save and exit, and it's about 50-50. And that being said, the people who want to save and exit can do that and leave and use our quick links or just go right to our playlist and the next video in line. Meanwhile, the people who want to finish it will have that luxury available to them as well. So I feel like it's the best of both worlds. And speaking of the best of both worlds, I feel like uh, this two-legged human that's flying this <laughs> speeder here is going to be all right. Guess what? 
Booyaka Shao. We have officially finished Free Play Level 2. Now we are pulling into Hoth. The reason is this is where we grabbed our data card for our preparing for free play, and we've never left the area. We will come back and finish this free roam area later, but not now. We're going to go ahead and worry about the free play. And woo to the who, the Boon to Eve classic is co -co -co complete. We got that 50,000 stud status requirement and more. In fact, look at that. We were sitting pretty with an extra 14K. We'll go ahead and add that up. We're almost to, we're about three quarters of a million. All three of these challenges, eat my exhaust, it's Skywalker and take over, co -co complete. And of course we got all five of those mini kits too, which are gonna assemble into a micro fighter. This one's actually pretty noticeable already. It's the Naboo Royal Starship. So, woo to the who! We got ourselves a Naboo Royal Starship. <laughs> Characters unlocked in story, and that is going to wrap it up. So, hopefully you guys are enjoying this free play series. Hopefully it's providing some insight and help to you guys, as maybe a smile or two. Don't forget to check out the Thumby Must See video, which should be the next video in line. HappyThumbsGaming.com is the home of our trophy achievement guides and more. Big shout out to Tyler P for busting out this one so quickly. And of course, social media is available if you're into that kind of thing. As for me, that's going to do it. As always, until next time.